everyone, welcome back. In this video, we are going to discuss how to create a basic module in Odoo 17. I will show you a demo by creating a basic module, Travels Management, which deals the Travels booking details. For that, let's go to PyCharm and create a custom directory inside Odoo 17. So I'm going to create a custom directory. And inside it, we can create a directory for our module. So let's create a Python. So let's create a Python package named Travels Management. So here you can see there is an init file. The init file is used to make the module or the directory is act like a Python package and it is used to initialize our module. We need to create a manifest file. So let's create a, a Python file. Give the name underscore manifest underscore dot py. Okay. This file is a, this file contains metadata about our module. Inside it, we can define the basic information about the module such as name, version, category, dependencies, etc. Let's copy this. Paste it over here. Here, I have provided the name, description, summary, category, and dependencies, etc. The keyword depends is used to specify the dependencies of your module. Define dependencies uh, you are telling auto that your module requires certain functionalities provided by other module and next is the data the data key is used to specify that uh, the specified files that need to be loaded into the database when the module is installed it typically include xml files and csv files next we can add license and set installable auto install application Next, we need to define the model for our module. For that, let's create a Python directory inside our module travels management. And inside this model, we can create Python file. I'm going to create a new class with the name travels.management. So I'm giving the name as travels management for this file. Okay. And inside it, we can define a new class. The model can be created by creating a Python class. And this class should be in, should inherit from models.model. So let's create a class travels management. That inherit models that inherit from models dot model. Can give the name. Now we need to import models from Odo. Next we can add some fields. So I'm going to copy this and paste it over here. Here I have added some fields, booking reference, partner ID, product ID, company ID, number of passengers, booking date, and state. Next, we need to import the term field. So in this way, we can create a new class and fields. Next, we need to create a security for our model. The security allows you to control who can access your module and what they can do with the data and what menus and actions are available to them. So let's create a security directory inside our module. Okay. 
and inside this directory create a csv file with the name with the name and inside it we can create security rule by defining id name model id group id and the permissions for it right create and unlink i'm copying this and paste it over here so you can see here i have given the id name and model id group id and the complete permissions the model id should be a uh, model underscore model model name so in this case it is model underscore travels management next we need to create or a view for our model for that let's create a view directory and inside this views we can create an XML file for defining the views and inside it I have created a form view and a tree view then created an action and a main menu travels management and a child menu booking with the action now we have created the views menus and action next we need to add the xml and security file inside the manifest so for that inside the manifest copy the path of csv file and paste it over here inside the codes yep. next let's add the path of view file then in model models init file we need to import Python file travels management. So from dot import travels management and in modules init file we need to import the models directory. So from dot import modules. After that, copy the path of our custom directory, my custom, and add it in the order dot cons. And let's run the program. Back to UI. Update the app, please. Then search for our module travels management. So here you can see our module has been added. Now install this module. Here you can see our module and the review. Let's, let's create a new record. Then if you go to settings and under technicals, go to models, then search for our model. You can see the associated fields, security rules, and the views. So in this way, we can create a basic module in Odoo 17. Thank you for watching.